what's up you guys it's your girl christina and today you guys today i am back again with another video today for you guys so if you're new here welcome to my channel if you're a returning subscriber welcome back to my channel so in today's video we will be doing a what's in my gym bag video today so without further ado without further ado make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on all post notifications and let's go ahead and get into the video you guys so i have my gym bag right here and yes it is transparent and i'm basically just going to show you guys some things that i keep in my gym bag that i take with me to the gym that's essential to me so we're going to start with this first so in the front of my bag as y'all can see i have compartment it's a big compartment a small compartment and also like a bottom compartment but i basically just use like the big and the second to big compartment so we're going to open the second to biggest compartment oh i can't even open it y'all So in this compartment, I have this hat, like this visor thing that I just like to put on my head sometimes, like in a, when I'm in the gym, when I go outside for a walk, it blocks the sun out my eyes, it keeps me cool sometimes, and it also stops the sweat from coming down into my face. And sometimes I wear it in the gym because it's like a, a sweatband, and it like helps prevent sweat from rolling down my face and stuff, and my head sweat. So. I love my little visor hat. I also keep hand sanitizer. You know, when you touch different equipment, your hands can feel kind of nasty. Plus, a lot of other people's hands are on the equipment too. And sometimes I just don't trust that sanitizer they have in there. So I just love to have my own little sanitizer. And also, you can't have chap lips when you in the gym. So I just have my little um chapstick that I got from the dentist, y'all. And um, I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but. But yeah, I have my little chapstick and my little hand sanitizer and it's orange and it smells amazing. I also keep my pads in here, you know. I keep my pads in there just in case you come on and you're not aware that your period is going to come on. Or if you are on and when you get to the gym, you didn't have a pad change, you can know how heavy or light you are. So I always like to keep two extra pads in my um, bag just for those purposes because you never know sometimes you guys I also love to keep lotion I love to keep lotion in my bag as well just because sometimes my skin be feeling a little dry and I just need some moisture moisturization on my skin or maybe I just want to smell good and put some lotion on my skin depending on what day it is because if it's leg day you don't want no lotion on your legs because your legs be slipping and stuff like that and that's bad so i try just to do it on upper body day or if it is leg day i like to put it on my arms and then wash it off my hands so that way my hands won't be like slippery i hate that i know i'm not the only one but sometimes like my hands they sweat a lot and i hate that y'all so i try to put lotion on my hands when i'm going to the gym i also like my claw clip that's in my hair ties my little scrunchies i have multiple big ones small ones my little claw clip and this huge one right here i uh, i love to use a claw clip like when it's upper body day um or when i'm like on my stomach but not so much if i'm on my back and i'm like pushing heavy weights up just because the claw clip gets annoying so i also like to use like my little scrunchies that i have right here and that's also like for my braids or whatnot and this is also for like my super long braids or my medium braids that these can't fit in and this is also for like my poof my natural hair so that way I can keep my hair up and tied and out the way so I have so many different clips in my gym bag just depending on my hairstyle so essential y'all these are essential and you can't forget the hairbrush um my hairbrush this hairbrush is mainly for this hair just to keep it um not tangled up 
I'm sorry if y'all hear that squeaky and that's like my chair. <laughs> so if y'all hear that, that's what it is. It's my it's my chair that I'm sitting in. But yeah, this hair, this brush is mainly for this kind of hair, just to keep it detangled and so that way it won't get tangled up and that it still looks nice. So this is what this brush is for. And it's, you know, for other people, long girls that got straight, other girls that have straight hair, curly hair, you know, you're gonna want a hairbrush. <laughs> um, I have my, I call this my sweat towel, cause I sweat really bad sometimes in the gym. And I really need something to wipe my face off. Cause sometimes like when I don't have this, I have to use the paper towels. And the paper towel is like, ugh, I don't wanna put this on my face. So I always try to bring a little washcloth with me. And yeah. Even though they have their own wipes where they wipe their equipment off, I also have my own little wet wipes, their hand wipes for your face. It's also compared with my hand sanitizer, but I also use it for the mats that they provide in the gym or any equipment that they provide in the gym. I love to have my wipes, my own personal wipes, just so that way I can wipe all the germs off and I know that these antibacterial wipes will get the job done. So I love me some wipes. These right here are lifesavers. So if you lift, like you do the trap bar, if you do roaming and deadlifts, if you are doing bench presses or you're holding dumbbells for a very long time, then your hands, like right here, they get very sore and they hurt super duper bad. So this is what the gloves come in handy. And it's also like when you're lifting and it's like your wrist kind of hurts, it, it helps with that too. Um, it has wrist support and it protects your hands. So I'm gonna get y'all a closer look so y'all can see at this glue. So as you can see right here, it has padding right here to protect that, that part of your hand. And I also have padding all in here too to protect your hands. This part is like a wrap and it protects your wrist, especially like when you're doing squats, backward squats, and you have to go down, come up. Sometimes your wrist can start hurting, or when you're doing like the bench is like behind you, you're in front of the bench and you're pushing up, going up and down, your wrist can start hurting. And because you don't have no support on your wrist, these can help. So I'm gonna show y'all. I just said that this wraps like that. Pull my clothes up, and you basically just put you know your hands in here. Like that, like I said, it's protecting all of this. Cause that's when my hands be hurting most. Sometimes I hurt up here, but it's also a little patterns right here to help with that too. And then you just simply just wrap around and it helps with your wrist and your wrist won't hurt for that full control. So if you see me in the gym with these, that's why I got sensitive hands and I want to keep my hands pretty alone, keep my body pretty too. Okay, so yeah, that's what these are for. So if you don't got none, go get you some off Amazon. It don't cost that much. It's very cheap. Um, you don't have to have the exact ones that I have, but I do recommend you get some with some wrist, wrist supports just to protect your wrist, you know, from injuries and other things. I also have these. These are like, I don't know what to call these y'all to be honest, but you wrap these around your um your ankles and you do exercises with them. Depending on what kind of exercise you're doing, you're gonna want some of these. Sometimes my exercises don't require these, but I always keep these in my gym bag just because I don't know what day it's gonna be. And sometimes I'll be in a rush and I'm just like, I need my gym bag, I need this, I need that, and it's already in here and I don't have to worry about it. So if you need this, just keep it in your bag. If not, cool. I do want to get the ones where they're like this, but they're not connected. So that way I can do my little donkey kicks, but on the machine. I don't know if y'all know what I'm talking about. I may or may not insert a picture on the side so y'all can see what I'm talking about. But yeah, that's soon to be in my gym bag. So yeah. And then next, I have some deodorant y'all I have to get me some more deodorant wipes but sometimes like I'm very cautious when I'm in the gym because the last thing I want to be is musty 
working out and I just very cautious about that so I love to keep extra deodorant in my gym bag just to be sure natural see I have two so it's no excuses and I also need to get some more deodorant wipes that way I can wipe the old off and then pat dry or let it air dry and then put some new on but I can't be the only one so you don't want to be stanky you don't want to Use some equipment, you stink, or you stink to hold gym up because you must be, you don't got none of this. So it happens, you know, some of us sweat harder than others, like I'm one of them. And some people sweat harder than me, and you're gonna need some deodorant and some deodorant wipes just to keep you fresh. And that's okay. Okay, especially like if your um, arms are out, because sometimes a lot of people just go on their sports bra, like this one, and um, go in the gym and work out, and you sweat, and it's nothing to catch that and you must be so some deodorant okay please deodorant and some deodorant wipes life savings and then last but certainly certain certainly not least my resistant bands you guys so these I use this for extra resistance like when I'm doing it's like when I'm doing squats, body weight squats, or when I'm basically doing any of this, these just go around my thighs. This one is when I'm doing body weight workouts, but I want to add a little bit more resistance on my booty. So this is my booty band. As you can see, it's a little more stretchier, which I'm finishing that right now. So it's also longer. <laughs> And as you can see, this one is longer than this one. So this is my booty band. You know, it goes around, it stretches out, goes around my butt, well, under my butt. And then this one stops at my thighs. As y'all can see, this is not as stretchy. Don't stretch as easy as this one. So two different bands for two different reasons, okay? And then this is like a regular little band for extra resistance if you're just starting out. And then these are my other bands that I use for other exercises depending on my days. Most of the time I use my resistance bands when I'm home and when I'm working at home. Working out at home or working out in someone else's house. I have my resistance because everybody don't have weights. So get some resistance bands and you're good to go. I also have gum that's empty. I didn't remember. Oh, it's one more piece in here. I love to have gum that you want when I'm working out just to keep my breath fresh. As you see, I need another one, but I love to keep my breath, breath fresh when I'm working out. And I just love to chew on something. It's like a stress reliever for me. But yeah. Then I also have my Carmex in here. As y'all see, I'm very prepared when it comes down to the gym, especially with my lips, because you don't want no crusty lips when you're in the gym. Okay. So. This is all of my stuff for right now. And then of course, hold on. Let me get this stuff in here first. I'm getting ahead of myself, y'all. One thing I do need to add is some wireless headphones, you guys. Headphones or earbuds. I'm actually planning on um ordering some, but I just don't know when, but I am planning on ordering me some wireless headphones. But sometimes y'all have the gym music be cool, be lit. And I just listen to that sometimes, or sometimes I just play it out loud. Just depends, sometimes I don't listen to music at all. And yeah, I mean music, earphone is really not an essential thing that I absolutely need. It's not something that I need. I mean, when I'm in the gym, I automatically go in the zone. I get in my zone, I do my workout, and I get out. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But is it helpful? Absolutely. Music is helpful. It drives you better sometimes. But me, don't really matter with me. Okay? Next, you can't forget your water bottle, y'all. I have this water bottle that I like. I usually fill up you know and it also keeps me on track all day so this is like my everyday water bottle sometimes I just get a regular water bottle but I really try to use this um as far as you drink water you need to drink at least half of your body weight half of your body weight I drink seven bottles a day I try to try to that's a lot of water to drink a day y'all so I try my best to drink seven a day sometimes full but I try my best to drink seven and this helps <clears throat> 
and then of course you got your workout shoes depending on the day depends on the shoes that i wear i do want to purchase me some converses for leg day just because converses are flat and when you're squatting and when you're doing your leg things you get like i don't know it's better i don't know i just know it's better don't ask me how it's better i just know it's better it even feels better when you're wearing flat shoes so sometimes like if i'm leg day and i'm no gonna be squatting i don't even wear my shoes i just take my shoes off and wear my socks literally so yeah and i also have a black pair that i keep in the car because sometimes i forget to grab these and i'd be in big trouble <laughs> i'd be in big big trouble so i make sure i keep me some shoes in the car and yeah so that's basically everything i keep in my gym bag um if you enjoyed this video make sure you comment down below comment some things that you keep in your gym bag i would love to know what you keep in your gym bag if we keep some of the same things if you keep something different in yours and want to share some tips with me or what you keep in yours you know i love i'm open to all tips all opinions that's the negative ones keep your negative thoughts to yourselves okay and yeah so without further ado if you enjoyed this video give it a big big thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next upload peace out babes